Hi guys! Um, I am here today with NO 1404. Um, this is one of my favorite games. I lose hours and hours and days and days on it, to be completely honest. <laughs> it's awesome. Um, the problem with it though is that it, it just goes on and on forever as far as I can tell. Um, I've played a few scenarios before, but I really suck at them, so I thought we could Way start anchor to set out on a new adventure. We could start a new a new game together. Um I will probably not play and play and play and make an infinite series from this. So we'll just go until I fail or until I get bored of this or until you guys get bored of this, so let's go. Um, when it loads, it has all these really cute things that they say down here in the um, bar, like they're filling the ocean. The idea of this game is to um, build a civilization and fill all of the people's needs. Um, and as they, um, as you fill those needs, they want more and more and more. start out on this little island with uh, none of the map explored. Yeah, thriving metropolis. I turned their voices right down because they um, interrupt really loudly all the time. So it has flashing <laughs> stuff when you need to look at it. So the first thing you need to do is build a marketplace. Um, now, as some of you probably know, I'm a terrible city planner. But this will have to do. And we gotta build some roads. Roads are super important in this game. And luckily it's not like black and white too where you have it's not a very intuitive road building system. Um, now when I start out building a town, um, I like to keep in mind that these people like people like to um when they are going to upgrade from civilian peasant to civilian, they need a church, and the church is a massive, and they can be tricky to place. So I like to keep that in mind um, when I'm building around here. Um, now, as you probably noticed, when I was playing around, um, the buildings have rings of influence that you need to build within. Market, small market buildings will give you more influence to build in. So I'm going to build this over here where there's not a lot of trees. Uh, and I'm actually going to start with building lumber yards. You start out with a pretty small amount of pretty small amount of um, tools. Um, now the lumber yards, they create their own trees when you build them, but I like to fill in the gaps. If you hold it down, it builds it's money, it's gold, but um, it makes the pr productivity of your lumber yards really, really good. Now everything you build has to be connected by a road. <laughs> and I am terrible at this. Um, and I like to make the roads as very little as possible, interfering with the lumber yards. And I messed it up. No, nope, this one. So they, when you click on them, it's like here, it's 100% capacity working at. This one's 100%. This one's 100%. So we're all good with that. Now I could safely, with my mind at ease, build buildings and hopefully not run out of wood anytime soon. Um, houses are the same. If they are not connected, you will have some people yelling at you and your houses will go derelict. If you don't meet your people's needs, similarly, they set the houses on fire <laughs> and everyone riots and it's very chaotic. Um, now, peasants, all they want to do is eat fish and, so let's see, all they want to do is eat fish and have a marketplace. Um, yes, so that's that. 
Uh, when you, I guess it's pet civilians need churches, I guess, to upgrade to the next ones. I thought it was peasants. I was wrong. Um, so, it's fairly... There is an undo button, I think. No, there's not an undo button. What is this button? Oh, I don't know anything. Okay, there's a delete button. Anyway. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> anyway. Um, these houses will soon go derelict if I don't build the roads to them. Alright, so, as you guys can probably tell, roads cost gold. Trees cost gold. These cost just wood. So, these are the most... If we build enough of this, we'll be able to build more stuff, hopefully. <laughs> Should probably connect up the fisherman's place. And I should actually probably connect up the marketplace. That was terrible. <laughs> oh well, still getting the hang of this building scenario. Alright, we're out of wood. Guess we should build some more lumber yards. Um, as your population grows, they require more of these things as well, like more fish, etc, etc. It's pretty self-explanatory. Your building opportunities have been expanded. Yay! Our building opportunities. That's good news, everyone. Okay, let's put some trees. Oh, 84% new. Um, you can see the when you build them, this little ring of influence is where he gets all his trees from. So each Your settlement has grown. Ooh. There we go. 90%. It looks like we can settle for that. Um, you earn honor from this guy as you go along. You can purchase some um, things from him. Soon he'll give me a boat, which will be good. Um, so now that we have opened up more opportunities, this is the church I was talking about. I already can't cover these buildings up here because of the way I've built everyone. Happens every time. I shouldn't build people around the marketplace. I think that's Oh no, we, we don't have enough wood. Yeah, the obvious thing would be that I... Um, that I should just not build them all packed in like this. Come on, lumber yards! Um, so, if we just... There is a little cart button that you can press when they have any wood in their storage and they come and pick it up straight away to everyone, I guess. So we'll soon have 12 more wood. And we can build our church. Come on, come on, one more wood. If you zoom down really low, you can see everyone moving around. It's quite, quite wonderful graphics actually. It's a beautiful game. Yes! 13 wood! Now we can build our holy place of holiness. There we go. And I will leave you guys there. So that is NO1404. Um, I would really like to keep doing this one. Let me know if you guys like it or if you think it's going to be boring. Um, I might just do it as like a every now and then thing. Um, make sure to subscribe and check me out on Facebook and Twitter, and I will see you guys next time. Grab them and drop them in the portal. I'm gonna get all the people. So let's keep let's keep this going. Ooh.